Am I a turkey? Do you need to wrap me? I'm getting sack of potato vibes. Oh, this is beautiful. I think I love Fashion Over. <sighs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for clicking on another video. Um, here we are again, deja vu. If you're wondering what I'm talking about then, please check out the video that you missed. My first dress haul. The whole purpose of this has been to find a nice dress to wear for my birthday. It's not that deep, you know, I'm not, I haven't rented out Albert Hall. Albert Hall, is that a party hall? I don't think so, but you, you know what I mean. I haven't made a big deal of my birthday. I'm just going for some drinks with my friends. And I just wanted to look nice, you know? Sometimes you just want to look nice, feel good, enjoy, celebrate, thank God for another year. And so Mission Fine Wine began, the search for the perfect birthday dress that would really sum up how I'm feeling turning 25. Pretty little thing let me down. Fashion over order has just arrived much later than I would have wanted it. And honestly, I wanted to return it to sender. I wanted to throw it in the bin. I wanted to let it burn at the bottom of a volcano. However, you guys encouraged me on my Instagram stories to see it through, to not give up. And you know what? That's what internet friends are for because I don't believe in giving up. I created a mission to be a fine wine for my birthday. And so here we are continuing that mission. Thank you for journeying with me. Thank you for being strong with me. Thank you for keeping me in your thoughts. I appreciate it. So today we are trying on, with much less enthusiasm might I add at the start of the video, we're trying on 200 pounds worth of fashion over dresses as were literally chosen by you guys. We also have a dress from Misguided and a couple of dresses from O Polly because in my moments of despair, as I'd sat there dressed like an ill-treated flamingo, um, I did do some more online shopping. I assumed that the Fashion Nova order had been sent by Pigeon, seeing that it hadn't arrived within the specified time frame that they said it would arrive. Um, so I gave up on that and I ordered some other dresses uh, from O Polly and Misguided. However, now they've all arrived, so we're just gonna try them all on. I want your honest feedback. Choose my birthday dress. I'm like done physically and emotionally, but you know what? No one was ever great by quitting. No fine wine was ever created in a rush. If you have to persevere and power through in order to taste the fruits of your well-fermented wine, do they ferment wine? I don't know, I'm not a wine connoisseur. I like cheap wine, like honestly, the cheaper the better, within reason, no vinegar. Um, what was I saying? That was it. The longer that it takes to make your fine wine, the better that it's gonna taste. So Mission Fine Wine is back. We're in a new environment, we're in my living room because honestly I think I have like trust issues associated with the previous video, the try on, just I, I relived that too many times. I love you guys, I'm so grateful for your comments but I relive the trauma every time someone says. Someone says how tragic it was. So we're in a new environment, we're gonna call in new things and we're gonna succeed. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment, uh, let me know your favorite dress. I'll be doing giveaways all the way through this month of September and I hope that you enjoy it. Let's go. Okay, so outfit number one is not making me angry, praise the Lord. Um, it is a cute little Jumpsuit, play suit, I always forget which one's which. Does anyone else forget? This is cute. I can't really remember why I ordered it, but I feel like I could wear this on the actual day, so the spa day that I'm going for with my mum. Um, I like the sleeves, I like I like what it's doing for me. I really like this, Oh, Faith restored, okay, I'm excited again. Oh no wait, lower your expectations and you won't be disappointed. But this is okay, it's all right. Sorry, not bothered. Do I look bothered? I'm so bothered. One thing though, which isn't so great, is this. <laughs> Anytime I, you know, move my arms a little bit too much, the buttons do become undone. So this is the second dress. What do you think? I'm like, I have mixed opinions right now. I feel like a little bit of a pinup doll with this. A shiny kind of material, which isn't the kindest. Is it a yay or a nay? What do you think? Let me know. You no, know, I do kind of feel like these outfits are 100% made for people who are shaped like a Coca-Cola bottle. And I'm more of your, mmm, I'm more of like a thumbprint. I don't really have like this like tiny pinched waist and massive hips that go out like the girls on Fashion Over. I'm more of an athletic figure. So I don't think it flatters me much in that way. Maybe I should use like a belt to pinch the waist a bit more. I don't know, I just feel a little bit like, superhero rather than snack. Is this my birthday outfit 
or am I a secret member of the Incredibles? Do you know what? It is super comfortable as well. That is a plus. I love being comfortable on a night out. And this, I could just nap in this. Oh my gosh, I could totally nap in this. Oh, this is beautiful. I think I love Fashion Over. This is so comfortable. So this one is a dress that I literally wasn't going to order until all of you guys voted for it and said yes, because I thought it looked nice, that I thought it was too much. And now I kind of like it, you know? It is small. Let me just... Uh, sort myself out with it. I've never worn anything like this before. I feel like it would be very warm because it's high neck and like I get a bit stressed with chokers because they tend to actually choke me. I don't know if I have a fat neck or something. I just like that's a bit much. It's a bit unnecessary. I was worried it might come across a bit like Game of Thrones, Jon Snow, Night's Watch, Mockingbird, Peter or Gale, which is not the look I'm going for. That's not 25 and feeling fine. Um, but I feel like I think it's very dramatic. I'm super conflicted. Is this a yes or a no? I like what the fit is doing for my waist. That is very much appreciated. And I think this is a dress that's actually adding something to my figure rather than the jumpsuit, which was just like, lol, head, you're on your own. Here it is a little bit closer up. I really like that detail. Oh. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. Think about it every night and day. Spread my wings and fly away. I believe I can soar. Let's see me running through that open door. I believe I can fly. I can fly. I believe I can fly. I can fly. I'm so sorry. Sorry, I was hungry so I just grabbed a Madonna. But look at this dress, come see. So this is the next dress. What do you think? I like this. I really like the colour. I feel like I've lost all faith. And this is just coming through. There's a sermon in here somewhere. Weeping may endure for the night, but joy cometh in the morning. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, I can't really breathe. Like this is very, very constrictive. It's a bandage dress and my boy, they mean bandage. Um, I feel like if I broke a rib, I wouldn't even bother going to any. I'll just pop this dress on and catch my organs back together. That's what the back is like. You guys, I really like this one. What do you think? You know, walking is difficult, but it's worth it. That's what you want. A dress that makes it worth it to struggle. This, I feel like it's worth the struggle right now. Honestly, it doubles up as a thoracic cage. It's cute, it's cheeky, but also kind of classy because it's long enough. I can't really call this classy, let's be honest. But it's like not too much. I think I can get away with a little bit of a, little bit of cleave. Next dress is this, which is giving me very much Kimmy K vibes. Okay. Ooh, I like this more than I think I should. Because it's like, it's a little bit tacky street. Why do I like this? This is so not me. This is not me. But it's a little bit of me right now. Here's the detail, which I'm not gonna lie, I feel like will one day turn to regret. That's the kind of thing you look back on and you know that it was 2018. Do you know what I mean? Like imagine we're in 2014, you see this and you're like, yeah, that was fashion over 2018. And you don't want, you want your style to be a bit more timeless. I feel like this is very limited to time. I might have to do two birthday parties, you know? <laughs> Just kidding. I can only go out like once a month now. Anything more? Absolutely not. I'd rather sleep. Okay, so this one, uh, 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 I don't really know. This isn't very me. It's very baby pink. It's very like ABBA meets. ABBA thought? Is ABBA thought a thing? I feel like if ABBA were thoughts, this is what this is what they would wear. It's not doing a lot for me. It's really, really emphasizing the old, the old these, whatever you want to call those. The material is like stretchy, but I, I like it. It's like a cheapy material, but I do like it. There's a lot of mobility. There's a lot of movement. You know, I like to be free. Maybe with the cheeky little belt as well, it could look quite cute. You know when they do the line that sews down the middle and it's basically designed to give you camel toe? I get those camel toe potential vibes. Is it a yay or a nay? 
let me know. Here is the final Fashion Nova dress. It is the same as the chocolate dress earlier, but in a gold color. Now, this is giving me more like tin foil vibes than fabulous vibes. Am I a turkey? Do you need to wrap me? Am I going in the oven? No, so why, why is it so shiny? I think the shininess makes it look even more cheap, I think. Maybe some people love this, maybe Turkey is their best life. Uh, with all due respect, I shall not be joining them. I am not a fan of this, but um, you know, it's not tragic. It's not making me angry. I don't want to burn it. I can't lie, I do not like Fashion Nova's return policy. If I did decide to return some of these, they're really like aggressive about it in terms of they won't even give you a refund. I would not recommend ordering it to try stuff on like I've done because now I feel very obliged to keep everything even though it's kind of a lot of stuff that I don't really need. So now we're moving on to Misguided. Um, this, this dress is very open chested. Now this dress was expensive. It was from their Peace and Love design and I'm not gonna lie, I loved it on the website. It looked amazing. All the reviews were great too. So I just had to order it even though it was 150, which is like maybe on my budget. But then I thought, I just thought maybe that's the reason I'm not succeeding on Mission Fine Wine. Maybe this whole cheap thing is actually catching up with me. And it feels more expensive, I'm not gonna lie. It's like heavy, like as I took it out of the packet. I felt like I was gladiator and the, this was like my chain mail, is that what you call it? It was dense, it was with weight, so it's a workout as well as a dress. I haven't zipped it up all the way, only because if I do, I don't think I'll be able to get it off by myself. I think I would need to pin it because otherwise it's actually showing everything. It's very extra, very extra, but kind of good extra. I could wear it with my hair up as well. And I never wear my hair up on nights out, ever. Look at this, you guys. I think if I wear this, I would probably be a bit overdressed. It's more like a New Year's in London at the shard kind of dress, you know? Okay, let me just get a safety pin to cover my dignity and we'll reassess. Popped in a safety pin and I've done my hair up. And you guys, I really like this dress. I'm like, I really like this dress. And it's weirdly comfortable and not itchy considering how many sequins are on this. I think it could be fitted better. This is a size eight. And apart from the arms, which I guess I'll have to come to accept that I must have large arms because every dress seems to not fit my arms. I actually think that it could be a bit like better fitted. But I like this one. I really love it, you guys. This is so ridiculously stupid. I'm shopping for my birthday dress for a night out in Cardiff, mate. You think I was getting married? Lol, wait till I'm getting married. Those videos will be good. They will be good. Also very comfortable. Obviously, if I lunge too far, one might see one's offspring. Uh, but generally, it's quite comfortable. I can move around. I'm not like having to walk with my knees together, which is never fun, you know? Okay, next dress from O Polly is coming up, but I don't want to take this one off. Okay, so we're in the home stretch. We've got two more dresses. These two dresses are from O Polly. I've never shopped there before. And um, this is the first dress. It's like a pink satiny dress. I can't lie. I'm still thinking about the last dress, but this one isn't too bad. It's not really me again. I don't know why I went for so much baby pink. It's not my style. Adjustable straps, which honestly have made it a lot easier to fit. Like it was too low at first, so I adjusted them. It's kind of still too low. Um, but that makes it really easy to adjust and fit to your waist. Because my waist evidently is not the same ratio as all these <laughs> built like a cola bottle models on the website. I'm getting sack of potato vibes. Oliver Twist, please sir, can I have some more gruel? Um, but I don't hate it. I don't know what's wrong with me, you guys. I don't hate this. I kind of like it. I think it's more of a day, a day ensemble <laughs> than a night one. You know when you used to do those sack races as a child? I feel like they've just gathered the sacks from all the primary schools and turned it into a dress. I'm not mad about it. I'm not mad about it, you know? And with like a nice little necklace. Maybe I'll wear this one to the spa day. Oh, I can't, I can't deal. What do you guys think? Is it a yay or a nay? I'm thinking yay. It almost feels like high fashion, like high. Yes, you can store potatoes in this, but I'm wearing it and it's fashion. It's got like quite a firm bit here, which I feel like it's supposed to kind of stick to you. It's not sticking, but it is holding its shape quite well. So even though I am, you know, 
flashing a nipple every now and then. It's not as frequent as some other garments would be. Okay guys, that is it for the dress haul. What a much more pleasant experience. <laughs> I am, I'm really happy with that, but also not happy with it because now what, am I gonna keep all these? It's so expensive, I need to send them back. Um, thank you so much for watching and for powering through with me on Mission Fine Wine. I feel like we have a good selection of dresses here and it's gonna be quite tough. I love trying on clothes with you guys and shopping with you guys. I love replying to all the comments. I just love sharing life with you guys. It's so much fun. Subscribe for more of September videos and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much. I love you more than words can say and I'm much happier than last time. So that is, that is good. I'm gonna take off the potato sack now.